Well, good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. We have terrific scenes in front of us at the Estadio dos Regal, one of the biggest venues in Portugal. A mouth-watering game this between two very high-quality sides. A treat for everybody here. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. There's the whistle. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Well, I'm going to go for the little wriggler, that is Raheem Sterling. Uh, his small frame and, and pace gives him a real advantage over bigger, slower defenders. And his turning sharpness is another very tricky part of his game, and he's a handful. OK, interesting. And that's put paid to a promising move. Finds himself eased off the ball. Nkunku drives it forward. Sterling. And it's Chilwell. Char chance! He's scored! Was there ever any doubt? Well, he always had the measure of the keeper there. Such confidence and composure. Real Madrid didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Forward it goes. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. It was a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Deep cross. Massive leap! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Chelsea can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Surely. He's had a go. Hoist it forward. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it.
Nkunku. Vinicius Junior. Plays it out to the flank. Lucas Vasquez could try cutting inside here. Danger averted for now. And that has been cleared. And that's another throw. Played into the middle. Goalkeeper's ball. Tries to get it forward quickly. And he's made sure that that won't get through. And it's played forward. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. Oh, terrible pass. Chilwell. Chilwell, who does have an assist to his name. Well, that's not the cross he had in mind. Forward it goes. Knocks it away. That will be the last act of the first half. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very... And we're underway again. Real Madrid don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. And oh, he's got that completely wrong. Badia Chile tries to get it forward quickly. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. Whipped in. Courtois claims it. Rudiger. Ceballos, Fran Garcia, up towards the front line. Real Madrid still behind thanks to that solitary strike. Nkunku, Sterling. He's in! And they're not going to make any further progress now. it is (laughs) 
Fran Garcia. Caballos. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, they may be down, but they're far from out. In terms of chances, they're right up there with these opponents. Caballos. Out to the left it goes. Looking for space out wide. Real Madrid are definitely going about this the right way. Yeah. Hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Just has to be done. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Loses his balance and loses the ball. What an adventurous run from a defender. Rudiger attempts a clearance. Whipped it again. Great leap! In it goes! And surely that does it! Perfect time! Decisive strike! It is a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. So that's two now without reply. Fran Garcia. Nkunku. Chilwell. Chilwell drives it forward. Been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Well, that's where he wants it. And it's the goalkeeper's to claim. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And it's Sterling. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Nkunku. And the weighted pass. That's gone a long way up and away. Tries to get it forward quickly. Vinicius Junior. Looks to dink one in. Brings it to a close. Real Madrid, puffed and puffed, but in the end, no joy. That's the game. The result is what matters, and this result is cruel. So what do you take away from it all, Jim?